Hey, this is Tyler, Theater Design Company. So, got a new camera, so we're gonna try that out today. Got a new mic, we're gonna try that out today. We also got a light for the camera. So, a bunch of new things going on today, and we're gonna try to start this video number three and uh, go over some of the fabric and uh, fabric track system. So, I've laid out a few of our uh, items we use for the fabric track system. Uh, first and foremost, um, Guilford of Maine fabric. So you can see we have just a, a million samples here. Um, these are all from various projects. These laid out are all the samples we tried for this room to get the color right. And what we've decided on is uh, this fabric here. I'm not sure if I can zoom into it or not. Um, the fabric itself has a little bit of charcoal hint to it, which will match the black on the screen. And then we've actually done the ceiling with a similar hue to that color as well. So that should blend in well. And then the gray, uh, the lighter gray or the ash color um, works well with the stone and as you can see the stone is now um, in place here and it's mortared in and we'll do a time lapse on this wall here and so we'll time lapse this wall with a uh, doing the fabric track and we've got to paint between the fabric track and the stone so there's no way to run the mortar out right to the edge so we found a paint that is uh, as close as we possibly can get it and we've even found some walnut shells to give the paint some texture. And so let's jump back here to some of the fabric tracks. So you can see here we're using uh, two different things here. We've got a perimeter um, square edge and then we've got a perimeter, um, or excuse me, we have a mid wall um, non beveled for the center and that'll give us an element of five panels and we'll create a seam. And, uh, here you can see different uh, bevels. So here's a perimeter beveled edge. And again, I'm getting this camera sorted out with the light, so I apologize, but I think it's gonna make uh, some better videos when we're done here. So this has a beveled edge. We're obviously doing a square edge, which is this one, so this is a perimeter square. And then on our case, we're doing a mid wall square. It's got just a, a nice seam. It gives you about a 16th to an eighth inch seam down the middle giving it a nice shadow line and effect and then if you really wanted to get a little more aggressive here's a mid wall bevel Let's see if I can zoom in on that but it's got a beveled edge these are uh, test pieces this is from kinetic noise control that's our go-to uh, company for fabric track systems again Guilford of Maine fabric and then a few of the tools we use for fabric systems so a couple of tools here little edge and then you need the little scissors to do this so we get those sharpened a couple times a year and then a couple of quick things to go over and then I'll get into doing the uh, time lapse of me doing one fabric wall um, here's some of the fabric uh, acoustical panel so we put these beneath the uh, kinetic noise so you've got one inch track um, it's actually an inch and an eighth and most of the material we're using is one inch so we have a tad diffusion panel and as you can see on those those are one inch thick with a hard face with the holes in it so it's kind of a kind of a mixture of a diffusion and an absor absorption panel and then we use an off three and six pound uh, insulation board for the rest of our areas and then you can kind of see just right in here we've got some uh, kinetic noise stealth diffusers and that's for the back wall here so we got a four foot by a nearly four foot diffusion panel on the back wall which is always a nice feature you'll see a lot of theaters that'll have diffusions uh, one other quick note this grill this is actually the surround speaker so I'm gonna get some grief for this from the guys that saying this isn't on the same bed layer or however they want to put it but uh, to be quite honest the seating is about seven feet from there and this room has a low ceiling of about seven feet on the back row and eight feet in the front so your ears will be way better than mine and a lot better than the microphone system using to tune it if you can catch that so other than that i'll uh, i'll end the video here on this part and then we'll get a time lapse and then i'll recap with a few of the uh, favorite products we use from this kinetic noise guilford domain fabric and when we order these these are what we order for customer for swatches so if you're doing a fabric wall system with us we end up ordering these so you can see all the colors and matter of fact, jump into this one here. This is what our front screen wall will be. Um, it's the Anchorage and uh, we use Onyx, that's midnight. And this bag here 
is the onyx color but you can also do their deep black color a lot of guys like the uh, anchorage and the burgundy and then you can get into some textures here which are pretty neat even some metallics and if you want to go plain you've got anchorage again white these are a lot of typical fabric colors. As you can see, these are all just samples from customers, even one we thought we might be doing some green, a tweed. So again, tons of colors for all this. Thank you.